Tragedy in Haiti is also being felt here in Fort Wayne. News Channel 15's Chris Hopper spoke to a few people who are worried about some folks back home in their home country. Morgan, I spoke to a couple of Haitian immigrants who are still waiting to hear from their family and friends. I also sat down with a Haitian man who just so happened to be visiting Fort Wayne when his country was leveled by this earthquake. We introduced you to Jean-Louis Toussaint in 2007 when he came here for a heart procedure. Jean-Louis recently came back to the States to get a checkup and visit some old friends. Then the earthquake rocked his country. Now Jean-Louis' main concern is his family. But all he can do now is wait and watch the nonstop coverage while the people in his homeland suffer. Like, like Jean-Louis, the Riaz family can't pull themselves from the television. The Haitian immigrants still have not heard from their family or friends. They all just want to go home. There is no word to describe it, really. I mean, you kind of feel kind of shock and shock shelled and you just feel helpless because here you all the way over here you can't really help anyone and you're trying to call and the phone lines are all flooded you can't get through I could tell he was very touched and upset by it um, you know because like the presidential palace that fell is very near his home Catherine Riaz and her husband are trying to gather items and money to take to Haiti they're just waiting for the okay to take a flight over there if you'd like to help them out, you can go to Wayne.com to get their information. Jean-Louis is also waiting for the okay to head back to his home country. His host parents tell me he watched the coverage for hours last night. They say although he can't speak much English, you can really tell he's hurting with his people. Chris Hopper, News Channel 15.